I too is small equally charged sphere each of mass m are suspended from the same point by by a silk thread of length l the distance between the two sphere which is x which is very less compared to l find the rate dq by dt with which the charge leak off each sphere from each sphere if their approach velocity varies as v equal to one of a upon under root v where a is a constant this is a question from i rodo uh, 3.3 and asked uh, by my student path bhargo uh, this problem can be solved here we have shown its uh, diagram the two uh, charge sphere uh, as like charged repel each other so they will they will uh, theta degree two theta actually as shown from the diagram diverge and there are three forces acting on each sphere uh, the electric force f which is away from the two spheres and mg downward and tension along the string here x is 2l sin theta x is the distance between the two charges yes and x is given in the question given it is given that x is very small compared to l hence theta will be close to zero very very small so sin theta will be approximately equal to tan theta and it can be replaced by theta where theta is will be in radian f the electric force between two charges will be equal to f equal to 1 by 4 pi epsilon naught q square upon x square Elect i have reserved the tension in vertical and horizontal component t cos theta and t sin theta as the spheres are in equilibrium and the net force on each charge sphere will be zero so t sin theta will balanced out f while t cos theta will balanced out mg so the equation is f is electric force since the balls are in equilibrium, hence the net force on each charge particle will be each part sphere will be zero. T sine theta will be equal to F and T cos theta will be equal to Mg. We have the we have formed these two equation. Now if we divide them, if we divide them we get tan theta equal to F by Mg. Now f equal to mg tan theta. I can write it as f equal to mg tan theta. Since theta is small, so tan theta will be replaced by sin theta. And sin theta from uh, as L x equal to l sin theta, we can write sin theta as a uh, x by two l, right? yes it is from this equation now put the value of f k q square by x square k is here one one upon four pi epsilon naught so k will be equal to k square will be equal to transferring other quantity to the other side of equal sign mg upon 2 k l x cube right so k k uh, q equal to mg upon 2 kl 
raised to the power 1 by 2 x power 3 by 2 right differentiating this equation with respect to time with respect to time dq by dt equal to mg by 2 kl this quantity in bracket is constant so we it will come out and differentiating x power 3 by 2 it will get 3 by 2 x power raised to power half dx by dt dx by dt is here velocity of approach of the two spheres so dq dx by dt is equal to velocity of approach equal to a by root x this is given in the question so dq by dt equal to mg upon 2 kl power half 3 by 2 x2 to raised to the power 1 by 2 and into a upon root x now root x and root x will be cancelled out right so this equal to 3 by 2a mg by 2ql to putting the value of k 1 by 4 pi epsilon naught yes into l 3 by 2a right so this will be 2 pi epsilon naught mg upon l raised to power half 3 by 2a 3a by 2 and this equal to the answer this will be the answer thank you